Hey pimps, it's Madam Wario. Welcome back to more Let's Play Animal Crossing New Leaf Welcome Amiibo where it is pouring down rain in Big Pimp. But we're not going to let that stop us today. We've got our flame and hot outfit on, our funny glasses, and we are talking to none other than the frogoist frog in Big Pimp. It is Camo Frog. He's so tiny. I just love how tiny he is with that deep, deep voice. Rain is so awesome. I just want it to keep raining forever and then some more. So what's up? Let's talk. When Rodeo came to my place to hang out the other day, he left something behind. Of course, we will give it to him for you because we are just such good friends. I still love your pinky dress. Frogo. His name's not even Camo Frog anymore. I just call him Frogo. It was an accident that just, a happy accident, just stayed. Now, Frogo's too, too cool for an umbrella. Um, and it may have something to do with his cranky personality. Yes, he is another cranky villager, as they are the deep voiced villager. They're also my favorite kind of villager, so, um, I really love that this little guy has this deep voice and that he is just a frog standing out in the rain just loving it um i love the concept for him as well i think he was a very clever named and um very cleverly designed character also let me show this off really quick tammy is wearing the police shirt that well she's made it into a shirt it's the police sign so i think it's really funny um i had to show this off though because i think it's so so cute oh my gosh so anyway um yes where did he go where'd you go there you are frogo is a grouchy villager his birthday is on june 5th so we will see that at the tail end of this project like after the entire year has gone by close to the one year anniversary of this project starting um so hopefully he's still around then and his coffee of choice is a blue mountain coffee with two sugars and the regular amount of milk he is in every single animal crossing game to date so he's been in every single game in the series who could leave out camo frog like let's be real he's amazing so i absolutely love him and he's definitely one of my favorite villagers just of all time i would say um okay where are we going rodeo is that who we're... Okay, well, he's on a freaking snack run, so... Yeah, it is to rodeo. Um, I guess we'll kind of run around. I think I bred more flowers up here, did I? Oh, no. My eyes deceived me. Oh, well. I thought I saw a fun new color, but I guess not. Man, it is, like, really coming down. Ooh, a leaf bug. Yes! Give me that. Katie did. No. Oh. I don't th I think we've caught one of these already. A walking leaf! I saw one of these for real, like, last week. Oh, there you are. Oh no, I'm sorry! I didn't mean to do that! Um, I saw a real, like, huge leaf bug. It was so, so cool. Um, just last week when I was out on a walk, and I've never really seen one up close, and it was like, almost- it was like half the size of my hand. Like, it was gigantic. So, I, I was really excited to to see that leaf bug that Katie did, so. Okay, thank you for the shirt. What is it? It's a raglan tea! Something I don't want, but okay, thanks. Okay, anyway. Um, so, Red is here. I wanted to show off the paintings really quickly because I already designated one for myself because it's another painting that is always genuine, so... All right, yeah, I know. Okay. Um, so, this painting, which is the Moody painting, I hardly ever see this one. Like, seriously, I never see this one. Like, hardly ever. Uh, but it is always genuine. There's nothing about it that will not be genuine, so make sure to snag that whenever you see it. Um, this one, I believe there's, like, the shell piece is, like, messed up or something. I know I've pointed this one out a thousand times, and this... Spherical head is not what we want. We want a nice, like, um, chiseled head that is of a straight, like, not... It's not round. It's just like a prince, fresh prince afro type thing. So, anyway, um, 
Somebody pointed out in the comments, last time I had two genuine paintings in here, and that was because I was wearing a lucky item, so that's pretty cool. I didn't actually know that was a thing, or that that could happen. Now, you can only buy one crazy red item at a time, so I mean, it, it doesn't really benefit you for that purpose, other than if your museum is space is almost full and you're looking for, you know, that last piece. Oh my god, are they talking? That is so cute! No, I thought I interrupted their conversation. We haven't really seen much of that. We haven't seen, like, a good conversation going on between villagers that we could just come and interrupt. And usually that happens all the time in my other town, but I've hardly ever seen that happen in this town. So everybody's very independent. Oh, you want cream soda. Okay. Um, that's pretty cool, I guess. How's it going, Tam? I love that her umbrella somehow, like, matches her shirt, though, even though it's just a random sign design. Oh, man. Bethany from Snow City again! Tammy's giving you a shout-out! Yeah! You work it, girl. Work. Okay. Oh, I have meow coupons. Alrighty. Um, let me collect my three coupons for reasons I don't know. And we're gonna check our letters now before writing something for Frogo. So, um, anyway, I've got three letters here. One is from Tammy, it's another friendship letter, so... Yo, madam, I don't tell you enough how grateful I am for you, so I'm writing you this letter. You rock. Thanks for being my friend. By the way, can we play hide and seek soon? I get to hide, Tammy. Oh, that's so sweet. I love when villagers just start writing you letters because they like you. No other reason other than that. Bianca says, Hiya, madam. What a passionate fan letter. This amazing poetry I wrote her. I've never felt so adored. Letters are totally hot right now, and you can read them whenever you need a lift. You'll write me again, right? Your idol, Bianca. Well, isn't she confident? All right, and then this one's from Beardo. Oh, you, you're so good at making me happy. Letter writing always makes me take a trip down memory lane. How about you? I await another reply. Your best friend, Beardo. To the listless madam. Oh my gosh. He's besties with us as well. All right, so let's go ahead and write Camo Frog a letter on this industrial paper. Um, let's see. Uh, let's be real. Your Frogo. Here we go. Got it. Yeah. All right, then I saved this gyroid out to send to him. I don't know what it looks like. I just thought it'd be funny to send Camo Frog a gyroid because his house is very eclectic and strange. So I'll go ahead and send his letter off. And then we'll go down and talk to him for a minute or two longer. And then we will be on our way. So if you've done the math right, you will have realized by now that there's only one villager left that we need to learn about, and that is Groucho. So Groucho is going to be the last villager we talk to, and his dedicated episode will be tomorrow. And then we'll be on our way to the final three episodes, or the final four episodes, I'm sorry. Um, the, but the final stretch, basically of the Big Pimp uh, Summer Project, the main portion, the main project in Let's Play Animal Crossing New Leaf will be on its way to an end. So, and I've got everything mapped out, so I'm really excited for the remainder of this week and how it's going to turn out. Um, no camper today. Well, good, because this will be a terrible day to go camping. Um, it's so rainy. So, so rainy. All right, where'd you go? Oh, hello. What's up, B? Are you gonna say something? What? Oh, come on. I've answered this once before. I'm gonna say Glitterax this time. 
<laughs> oh, I love it. Oh, man. Okay, I love that reference back to- you just blend in, Camo Frog. I love that reference back to the original game. Alright, what's the latest? No, you're not taking my regal dresser! You heard wrong! <laughs> oh my gosh. No, I'm- I found a regal dresser in the Nookling shop earlier today, and I- I need to get it customized to match the rest of our regal furniture, so I'm like, it's just in my pocket so I can do that. Then I'm a- Oh! I'm an individual now! I'm no longer a stump maker! Okay, good. My reputation's gone up, guys. I really didn't want to be a stump maker. Alright. Um, I'm good. I've been taking pictures this entire time, Camo Frog. Oh, shoot. Oh no, I did it wrong! Oh. Yeah, well luckily Tammy's right there so I can show this off, I guess. Now you can't tell because I've got my funny glasses on, but I got stung by a bee, so if I go talk to Tammy because she's an Uchi type, which is the big sister type, she's going to talk about my... Okay, she's gonna talk about my funny glasses. That's not what I wanted her to talk about. Okay, I might have to take them off. Let's see. Remove accessory. Now let's talk to her. There we go. <laughs> oh, she tries to like stand up for me. So, um, she's not judging me, but she's going to give me medicine because she is a big sister type. So I think it's super duper cute. That is also really funny that she couldn't tell because of my funny glasses. So if you use medicine, you will be all better. So that's pretty nice. So gotta love Tammy. So anyway, um, I'm bored. Wow, this might- okay. Oh, that's right! Is he like packed up yet? I keep checking and he's not. Um, I didn't check for today. But, no. Oh. No, he's freaking outside training again. Okay. Well, anyway, um, he's he will probably be packed up within the next couple days and just in his house. So at that stage in the game, you could have somebody visit your town to come and get said villager that is moving. Um, so that's a pretty cool feature that was added in New Leaf as well. So if, say... Like, for me, if one of my friends, and this is how I got Pinky to begin with, if one of my friends had Pinky move into his or her town, and then Pinky's like, hey, I'm moving out, all they'd have to do is tell me to come over when she is packed up and in boxes, and I can convince her to move to my town. So that's a pretty cool feature that was added. Um, Alright, well, anyway, today was all about Camel Frog and a couple of other things, but that's going to do it for this Tuesday episode of Animal Crossing. Thank you so much for watching. This has been Madame Wario, and I will see you tomorrow. Peace out, pimps.